blog updates. What is up guys, CHGS here, I'm going to with another video and in today's video guys, I'm going to be showing you an alternative to App Admin and guys, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, please do not see any more videos just like this. So guys, what you need to do is have a jailbreak and go on Cydia. Alright guys, so once you're on Cydia, you, you somehow just happen to know that App Admin is the way to go, so you tap in App Admin, right? And then you just go in there, right? And then you install it and you're like, oh yeah, it's gonna work, alright? I love this. Alright, so then you install everything. There's no errors, no errors on Cydia. That is, that's, that's, that's showing a good sign. And then all you gotta do is respring, right? Because you can see right there. So we're gonna go into App Admin real quick and uh, guys, my 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 uh, my Apple Store is messed up for some reason. I don't know why, but uh, I think App Admin did this. If you use App Admin, if you just hold the open button, it's basically going to bring up with options saying, "Hey, do you want to downgrade? Do you want to do this?" So, guys, this App Admin is not working anymore. I don't know why it's not working, but guys, what you need to do is just uninstall that. Boom! Get out of here. Respring your device like a motorcycle. All right, go back into City. Why don't you? Have deleted app admin all right so guys once you're on CD, what you need to do is you want to go on sources and once you're on sources you want to go on to plus plus sources if you if you don't have that then check out my video and i'll show you guys how to get that other uh, section so basically what you need to do is type in cook cook so basically right there we just got to tap that source right there and all you got to do now is just tap on add and we just basically going to add the source i'm also leave it down in the description but if you can't find it down in the description just look at my video and it's basically going to show you how to add sources faster all right, guys. So what you need to do now is just stop on read. Uh, I mean, go back to Syria. And okay, then once you have done that, good jazz. All you gotta do now is you go go on search and just type in App Store Plus Plus. All, right, all I gotta do now is just install this motorcycle right here. And this motorcycle is basically a replacement for for uh, App Admin. So, anyway, so just install it, confirm it, motorcycle. So once you have done that, good jazz. All you gotta do now is just respring your device. In need it's gonna respring and anyways guys what you need to do now is just launch up the app and just go on the Apple store and, and I, as you can see right there the Apple store is not messed up like it was at the beginning uh, when we used app admin once you once you hold the um, the open button it's basically gonna bring you with these options and basically there's a downgrade option you can use it you can do it manually you can uh, you can also block updates this app does not support uh, it does not support one of my hacks that I uh, I have in the, in my device. So basically, right now the these versions are just keep popping up. It, let me go on the app real quick and let me just show you why it's not working. Okay. So when I start, when I tap on thank you for iOS guys, so basically it just enables the hack, right? So like all that good jazz. And when I when I do this, it says fetching update. That this this is not even fetching an update. It's not even doing nothing. I am in a version that this hack does not support. So basically what I'm gonna do is go and downgrade my app. So I'm gonna go downgrade my app real quick so that it can support it can be supported with my hack. So I'm gonna go on to version 1.4.1. Okay, okay, so basically this is the version that it supports right now, 4.1. So it is almost done here. And uh, yeah, okay, so basically we're gonna launch it back up and let's see if it actually works this time. This time around. Alright, so then I want to just press and thank you and then thank you. Let's see if that message pops up again. But it, it won't. I bet, I bet it won't because it supports it. All right. So basically, that is it. If you don't want your app to get updated, all you got to do now is just go on here, block updates. Every time this app updates, it won't bring me back to the current version. It will just put me to 4.1. Anyways, guys, that'll be the end of the video. And I hope you all enjoyed it. And if you did, please leave a like. And if you didn't, please leave a dislike. Thank you again for watching this video. Tishia said is signing off.